India is one of those places that at some time makes it onto every traveler's bucket list because of how deeply traditional it is while also never ceasing to surprise. They might have fantasies about visiting Agra to see the Taj Mahal in all its splendor or touring the other royal palaces dotted across Rajasthan. Others are drawn to Goa's picture-perfect beaches or the breathtaking scenery in Darjeeling and Rishikesh. There are also the major cities of India, like New Delhi, Mumbai, and Kolkata, each of which has a unique personality. Exploring the temples, shops, and vibrant streets of India's largest cities is never boring. Choosing just what to visit while traveling through India is the most difficult portion of the trip. Whether you're going on an epic backpacking trip or a luxe vacation, plan your adventure with this list of the best places to visit in India. Before starting, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more future updates. So let's start. Number 16. Agra. The Taj Mahal would be the ideal representation of all of India if there could only be one emblem. Every year, the monument draws millions of visitors who get up early to travel to Agra to watch the beautiful building radiate at daybreak. However, Agra is the ideal site to visit in India for reasons that go beyond the country's most well-known tourist destination. The city in Uttar Pradesh is filled with magnificent Mughal structures, such as Itimad Yud Tomb Dalas and Akbar's Mausoleum that are covered from top to bottom in mesmerizing inlaid marble patterns. Additionally, visitors can visit the Agra Fort, another UNESCO World Heritage Site. Agra is a must-visit destination for travelers in India since it has so many wonders in one location. Number 15. Amritsar. The impressive Golden Temple is Amritsar's claim to fame as the Jewel of Punjab. The gilded building, one of the holiest places in the world for Sikhs, is a sight to behold as it glistens in the sunlight and reflects into the sizable pool that surrounds it. The site is home to the largest community kitchen in the world, which serves lentils and curries to 100,000 customers each day, including curious tourists. Spend an afternoon near the Pakistani border while you are in Amritsar to witness the beating retreat ceremony. In an extravagant ritual you won't soon forget, goose-stepping guards from longtime rivals India and Pakistan open and lock the border gates at dusk. Arrive early to join the locals in dancing to loud Bollywood music on the streets. Number 14. Andaman Islands. If you want a traditional beach holiday, head to India's Andaman Islands. You may enjoy the turquoise seas of the Andaman Sea, pastel-hued sunsets, powder-white sand beaches lined with coconut palms, and tangled forest vistas. There is no way a postcard could do justice to the majesty of this breathtaking location. Those who desire to visit one of the few dozen islands that are accessible to tourists may have difficulties due to its extremely remote location, which is closer to Indonesia than to mainland India. A domestic flight will be necessary from a large Indian city like Chennai, New Delhi, or Mumbai. Alternately, you may risk taking one of the lengthy ferries across the Bay of Bengal. But sometimes the payoff is well worth the effort. You'll witness rare birds and get the opportunity to see thriving coral reefs while having virtually exclusive access to some of India's best beaches. People who love culture and history will also enjoy exploring the slowly disappearing Victorian British ruins on Ross Island. Number 13. Assam. There are many excellent spots to visit in Assam that have all the ingredients that would cheer you from the fatigue of strenuous daily activities because the state is surrounded by vast natural beauty. Every time you blink, the natural splendor of this state, with its greenery and sun on top, would bring to mind vintage Bollywood films. Along with breathtaking sights, the state's religious side can be explored. Here are the top tourist destinations in Assam that you need to include on your travel itinerary for a fun exploration. Here is a list of the top attractions in Assam to visit for a wonderful trip. To learn more about the top Assam tourist attractions and activities, keep scrolling down and reading along. Additionally, Assam's stunning locations provide something special to every traveler. Number 12. Calcutta. The third largest city in India, Kolkata, is a crumbling example of British India's colonial-era architecture. The Victoria Memorial, a white marble structure with a museum and numerous galleries, and Park Street, a well-known avenue with stores and restaurants that are bustling 24-7, especially during the holidays, are two of the top things to do in Kolkata. However, both the sights and the feelings are important to Kolkata. The highs and lows of life are evident on every street in this city, which will somehow evoke all of your emotions. Be prepared and receptive to the experience. Number 11. Chennai. Chennai is the place for you to be on vacation if you don't mind the heat of the sun but appreciate some warmth from the hearts, if you don't mind the lack of lush grass but happy with the wealth of reception, 
and if you think the rich cultural background and the unassuming people are more essential. Not only is Chennai the fourth largest city in India, but it is also the 36th largest metropolitan area in the world. In Tamil Nadu, it is also on the list of must-see locations. The city is known as the cultural capital of India because of its extensive history and traditions. In the 17th century, the British founded Chennai. But the city has a rich history, as evidenced by some of its notable buildings, some of which have withstood the test of time and show that the city is far older than its recorded years. Number 10. Cochin. The city of Kochi, commonly referred to as the Queen of the Arabian Sea, is full of attractions that will brighten your day. As you read, you will see a list of some of the top tourist attractions in Kochi that you must visit. You can examine the well-known, unusually mechanized Chinese fishing nets. Between the Pardisi Synagogue and Madancheri Palace is Jew Town, where you can go for a stroll. Visit the Madancheri Palace or Dutch Palace to experience the serene ambiance and beauty of nature. This is a lot of excursions, but if you get tired of them, you can also travel 30 kilometers outside of Kochi to Cherai Beach to experience the true beauty of the beach. Fort Kochi Beach is another option. As you pray, take in the stunning architecture and atmosphere of the St. Francis Church. The Kerala Folklore Theater and Museum is a noteworthy location, it was constructed in 2009 and is a gigantic multi-story traditional edifice designed in the Malabar, Kochi, and Travancore architectural styles. Other well-known tourist destinations and activities in the area of Kochi include Willingdon Island, the Paradesi Synagogue, the Mangalavanam Bird Sanctuary, the Pierce Leslie Bungalow, and more. Number 9. Darjeeling. Darjeeling offers some of the best sightseeing opportunities in all of India. The West Bengal Hill region is well known for its verdant green tea plantations, majestic snow-capped peaks including Kongchenzonga, the third highest mountain in the world, and tranquil Buddhist monasteries. This is the ideal location to plan a mountain bike or trek excursion. Riding the Darjeeling Himalayan Railway is among the most well-liked activities in Darjeeling. The 140-year-old toy train transports visitors on two-hour enjoyable rides from Darjeeling to Goom, a route that is frequently cited as one of the most gorgeous train rides in the entire world. Number 8. New Delhi. New Delhi has a lot to offer visitors, despite the throngs of people in the mayhem. India's vibrant capital is the ideal fusion of tradition and modernity. Some of the most cherished landmarks in the nation may be found in Old Delhi, including the Jama Masjid, Red Fort, and Chanmi Chowk Market District. But there are innumerable other places of spiritual and cultural significance that visitors can visit all across the large city. The Lotus Temple, India Gate, Humayun's Tomb, and Kutub Minar, India's tallest tower, are some of New Delhi's most popular tourist destinations. Spend your days discovering these fascinating places and refilling at upscale eateries and streetside chai cellars. Number 7. Goa. India offers wonderful beaches in Goa, down south, in addition to its abundance of large cities and sacred places. Whether you're interested in hanging out with the backpacker population in laid-back beach huts or having a ritzy tropical break at a five-star resort, its expanses of golden sand along the Arabian Sea provide something for every type of traveler. Goa's fusion of Indian and Portuguese culture is one of its distinctive features. The combination is evident across the area, from the Baroque buildings and cathedrals to the spiciness of the vindaloo and seafood meals. Number 6. Jaipur. Without time in Jaipur, no journey to India is complete. Jaipur is a regal wonderland of culture and legacy, teeming with architectural jewels, and is affectionately known as the Pink City because to the blushing color of its historical structures. It is also a noteworthy stop on India's well-known Golden Triangle tourism route. Get ready to be mesmerized by the opulence of Rajasthan's capital, Jaipur. You may experience the opulent lifestyle enjoyed by the Jaipur royal family at City Palace. The Jantar Mantar Observatory's astronomy equipment is right next door, bringing the wonders of space to Earth. You could also be able to attend one of the numerous festivals that Jaipur hosts throughout the year, such as the International Kite Festival in January or the Elephant Festival in the early spring, depending on the time of year you visit. Number 5. Mumbai. Want to experience India from a more global perspective? Go to Mumbai, a vibrant coastal city that is home to the sexiest Bollywood actors and ultra-rich businessmen. In this opulent metropolis, visitors are seldom far from five-star hotels or fine dining establishments. Even if those activities are out of your price range, taking a stroll down Marine Drive and taking in the gorgeous views of the coastline and opulent Art Deco structures will make you feel like a king or queen. 
The busy, thieves' market and church gate train station, where millions of handmade lunches are daily packaged and delivered to the city's office workers, are additional places to witness a more genuine, local side of Mumbai. Don't forget to set aside a day to check out Sanjay Gandhi National Park and discover the 2,000-year-old engravings in Kaneri Cave. Number 4. Ranthambore National Park. Ranthambore National Park is one of the best national parks in India, providing a secure haven for tigers and numerous other wildlife species. The location, vegetation, and regal remnants of the stately fort are what distinguish this top wildlife reserve in the nation. Ranthambore thus not only represents the rich heritage of the state but also the premier location in India for tiger safaris. In addition, Trinetra Ganesh Temple, one of Rajasthan's oldest temples, is located not far from the national park. Ranthambore Fort, Trinetra Ganesh Temple, Padam Lake, Sirwal Lake, Kachita Valley, Jogi Mahal, Raj Bagh Ruins, Lakarta and Anantpura, Malik Talau, Akaula Region, Village Women Craft, Wild Dragon, and Ranthambore School of Art are some of the attractions in and near Ranthambore National Park. Number 3. Shimla. Tourists and residents alike travel to the hill stations, with Shimla being the most well-liked, when the temperatures soar in New Delhi and other towns in North India. A peaceful area to spend a weekend or longer, the cloudy skies and forested hillsides provide a welcome respite from the heat. Both the picturesque outer areas and the steep central area of the town have good atmospheres. Make a reservation on the UNESCO World Heritage Site Kalka Shimla Railway while you're nearby. The over a century old, 96.6 km long train is recognized for its breathtaking scenery and genuine vintage experience. Number 2. The Backwaters. India's backwaters are a popular tourist destination. There are many areas where one may see beaches and hill towns, but Kerala is special for having both, and they are both integral parts of its identity. Every traveler comes to this location because of the water's allure. The experience of staying on a houseboat is completely unique and has the potential to leave a lasting impression on the traveler's heart and spirit. Indian backwater tours are quite well liked among honeymooners and couples. One cannot help but fall in love because of the peaceful surroundings, the birds chirping, the soothing sound of the water's waves, the exquisiteness of the houseboats, and the graciousness of the locals. Alepi is the most popular backwater getaway in India. Additional Kerala backwater vacation spots include Kochi, Kori Kode, and Tiruvananthapuram. The months of September through March are the ideal times to explore these locations. Number 1. Varanasi. Varanasi, one of the oldest towns still inhabited today, is regarded as India's holiest site. Along the holy Ganges River, devotees engage in spiritual practices like as bathing and publicly burying recently deceased family members. On the other hand, Visitors can discover their own brand of spirituality by going on sunrise boat excursions, scattering floral blessings into the river, and viewing Hindu chanting rituals from cliffside ghats. Away from the ocean, the ancient town's winding alleyways resemble an infinite maze. Varanasi is said to have no reliable maps, and after seeing the maze-like city for yourself, you might start to believe this legend. This is it for today's video. Which place do you like the most? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more future updates. Thanks for watching.